Hi, and welcome to Mike's Garage. So I've got a quick update on my lead time batteries. So I don't know if you remember, but I mentioned that one of them, I couldn't charge it. I couldn't get it to work. I tried multiple different ways to charge it. It initially worked. The app showed it was 100%, but it just, I couldn't get anything out of it. And I connected up my meter and I was checking it on the, uh, uh, on the disconnect and it just, it wasn't there. I was getting 24 volts from one and it was in series with another one and I was only getting, you know, three volts from the one in question. So wasn't putting out what the, that it was supposed to work with lead time. We couldn't figure it out. It's, we, we were at the point to say, Hey, let's replace the battery. And then I had two of my subscribers, which I want to thank them both for this mention in the app hidden in there and i'll show you i'll put the pictures up hidden in the app uh there is an option to turn discharge on and off and it's, for some reason it got flipped off and that's why the battery wasn't working so i reached out to lead time i let them know i said hey you know what the battery doesn't need to be replaced i found a way to fix it and they're like really because we're not familiar with it can you can you make a video and tell us so i'm making this video i'm going to send this to lead time so they have it so they can understand what the fix is and when they're troubleshooting with the customer they could add this as one of the steps to troubleshoot so wanted to once again thank my subscribers they're obviously smarter than i am and i appreciate having good subscribers so thank you once again and thanks again for watching mike scrudge